Guys, last time we were at the store, we saw something that was just... The heck? What is that? Well, we saw this product. We were like, we have to get this. So let's go inside and show you because it's that epic. Where is it? Guys, check this out. I have never even heard of this brand. Hyper Toy Company? <laughs> what? We're used to this brand. Yeah. Power Wheels. But this is different. You wanna know why we like have to get this one? Is because check this out. It's got real shocks, okay? Legit. Like real. That just looks so sick. It's perfect for us ages three and up. That's us. Get it. Okay. Now we aren't sure how big this is. Um, I'm hoping it's at least big enough that we can fit. Well, here's what they look like in it. We're a little bit bigger than them, but not too much. <laughs> Are you serious? Five mile per hour max speed. You can go two miles per hour backwards. <laughs> so I was just thinking, so basically all these toy cars are like three to seven or three and up. When is a company gonna come out with like a super toy car that's like, you gotta be 12 or up to ride this. It's that advanced, it goes like 10 miles an hour. Oh, come on guys, where are you at? We would buy every single one, we promise. Quick, I wanna have fun. I'd like to note as well, out of all the toy cars we have bought, which are, would be four, we have not rode one single toy car inside. And that kind of seems like rebellious. That all changes today. We're riding it in this basement, whether mom says so or not. She's not gonna let us. Dude, this looks cool. What? Just look at this, the front of it. Dude, and those shocks. Get this out of here. I told you, this is cool. Pull. Ah! It's so difficult. This is looking beautiful. Look at these rims. Custom red rims. All the attention to detail from Hyper Toy Company. Let's go. I am so excited to try these out. Do you think they're actually gonna work? Yes. For show? No. Step one, attach the rear shock absorbers. Get the hex wrench. Oh, okay. Find the hex wrench. I can't. Also, here's a quick hack for you guys. If you or your parents buy one of these toy cars, make sure the very first thing you do is plug in the battery. Because, you know, sometimes assembling these things probably takes an hour. And by the time you're done, the thing's not even charging, you won't be able to drive it. But if it's charging the whole time, you could at least try it out. So, it's a little hack for you guys. It's time to attach the wheels, but I wanted to get your guys' opinion. What do you think? So you can either have the chrome, or just have pure red. So, that's another cool feature. Just put the rims on, check it out. Now put yours on as well. Ah! What? You okay? Ugh, what happened? We just need a quick power boost. I got some golden grams. We got a lot of options. I think I'm gonna get some peanut butter chocolate Cheerios. These are super good. Wow. This might be my favorite cereal. This is so good. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Just look at this. It's like lifted. You can see the shocks. This thing is much cooler than it shows. And look, they have buttons too. We'll obviously show you when we turn it on, but this is like, this is nice quality here. Yeah, low speed, going to high speed, whatever you need. We need to put on the steering wheel now. Okay. This one's easy, you just connect it. You got buttons on the steering wheel uh -huh. too? You can talk to mom. Mom, I gotta call you back. Mom, I gotta call you back. Another cool, unique thing about this car, look, the seats have a seat belt, so your kids don't fly out by doing some off-road trails. Come on, muscles. Get in there. When all else fails, just hit it hard. 
One of the most exciting features, guys. Andrew, show them the back of that thing. This is a light strip. So, so it literally lights up. I wonder if the front lights go too. This might be the coolest power toy that we own thus far. Power toy? I don't know. Yeah. So this thing is small. So what we might have to do is actually take out the light because I'm not sure if Andrew or I, definitely not Andrew, because he's taller than me. Let's see what you look like just at least trying to fit in it. What? Ow! I'm stuck. We're definitely gonna have to take that out. Ow! Ow! Get out! You got a ah. steering wheel, Kev. Ah! Wait, we can't. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> no! Whoa! Guys! It lights up in the front! Dude! That looks so cool! Those lights right here, they got even brakes in the back? What? I'm just kind of sad we have to take out this, but since we are bigger, this gives this area a seating area for us. So we might just sacrifice the lights. Maybe we can mod up in some lights later on, but let's take it off. Turn it off. Get it off. I mean, it still looks just as cool, but now, even the biggest of kids can fit comfortably. Wow. Let's go, uh -huh. we got horn. So like we said, low speed I think is like two miles an hour, but once you boost it up to high speed, it's five. So here's the low. Whoa, dude. This feels smooth. Really? Ready. Give me a countdown. Three, two, one. Dude! You gotta be kidding me. This thing is sick. Whoa! Dude. Oh. They actually kind of bounce. Dude, they do. Like, why when I got out, I felt it. But here's the big question. Since this isn't power wheels, this is a different battery, so, how long will this battery last is the question I'm wondering. Will it be longer than power wheels or will it be better? From this angle, it kind of looks like you have like underglow because of the reflection of the window. You give it a test now. Dude! Ow! Dude, this thing is legit. I know. We are authorized toy car reviewers since we do own a lot. We're able to compare the toy cars, and this is definitely up there with the top toy car we own. Not only is it cool looking, it feels good, it's got good power, this is the best one. Now, I think we need to take it off this jump. Oh no. I'm not kidding. With the shocks, it might be able to withstand. We've just made a way here for the launch. You start over here and go And this thing is actually lighter than all our other power wheels. How is it lighter, faster, and cooler? It's easier to lug around. And cheaper. <laughs> and we were able to just immediately mod it to fit our needs. Look at that jump. It's the, gotta be like 10 feet. This is like a huge off-road test for it. Can it land? These shocks have got to be expensive shocks. It just, man. Whoa! Nice! Yeah! We have got to take this thing outside. We can't just try it in the basement. We need a bunch of space to go full speed, at full capacity, full send. Am I right? Yeah! So we got like a little steep sidewalk here. So we're gonna see how full send a full send is. Uh -oh.
Whoa! All right! Woo! You have got to take it on the field. Me try. Okay. <laughs> it died? Yeah. Oh! We only charged it for like, what, 30 minutes? Yeah, so not bad for a 30 minute charge, but. Guys, we already have so many ideas with this new toy car. I am so excited. Leave a comment down below of some ideas you want to see us do with this guy. And click over here to watch the toy car video we did. We did shopping and toy cars on JC Studios. Real funny. And click over here to watch another video that YouTube recommends for you. Make sure you guys laugh daily. We'll see you next time. Goodbye. Whoa. Nuh-uh.